Hello everybody, welcome back to Morphin Junction video. Now this is going to be a review and unboxing of a 060 Terrier. And uh, this is uh, the local that I purchased yesterday. So the code number of this, it's a Hornby product, the code number is R2679. It's a Great Western Railway 060 formation. Uh, nice and massive, it's a Terrier Class A1X Porsche Sheet. How do you pronounce it? So I can't can't pronounce it very well unless I did pronounce it the first time correctly. I'm absolutely amazed. Uh, but apparently this loco is based somewhere in uh, Bristol Harbour, so that that was something new that I discovered when I purchased the I the item. Now what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to put this uh, fan on the stand so I can do some unboxing. So bear with me for a moment. Okay everybody, right, sorry about that. So you are now on the stand so I'm going to do the unboxing. So here we go. This is a, a second hand loco so I don't know what it's going to be like. So here we go. So you have the uh, operating and maintenance instructions, so there we go, plain and simple, so there you go, so I do want to keep that, especially safe somewhere, so for the time being I'll just put it with the box, but I will have a folder that have all these um, um, sheets, because I've got one for the Class 800, I've got one for the uh, Hogwarts Express, and uh, one to go for Loco. So I'm going to keep them all together. Now let's have a look at this Loco. If I take it out of the box. Now, I do like the Terriers, they're nice little Locos. But I love the detail on them. And it's got the bright vacuum pipes. My four wheel uh, coaches, the Hornby ones, the new Hornby ones. They have got the um, vacuum brake pipes, so that would be ideal just to haul about three or four of them at least, and uh, probably want to see bits of uh, small rolling freight stock, so we'll have a look anyway. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put this on the track and then we'll see it going around on the, on the loopy loop tape, okay? Okay then everybody, now we're on the, the loopy track, so i will shorten it because I'm at the process of sorting out my bedroom. Uh, I've got a lady that I need to contact, so I'm going to read that. These boxes here, you can that blue one, that one down there, and this. And uh, what is on my bed at the moment, apart from the washing. <laughs> so that's what I'm going to get rid of, but I'm going to sort that out uh, another way around. Not for any YouTube videos. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to let this run round on the electric track for a little bit and uh, let you see uh, see it running. And then what I'm going to do, I'm going to run it in after and I have got inside there the uh, 042 loco that I purchased a few days before I purchased this. I'm going to let that run in as well. So here we go then everybody. Let's see it running. Wrong way around. It is noisy, but apart from that, it looks like a really good runner. So if I just put you somewhere along here, you can see it going around and around a few times. And what I'm going to do, I'm not going to put any rolling stock on it because I'm going to have it running in. Once I get it running in, uh, I might just do a little bit of a running session. So, you never know. Enjoy. And uh, just to give you guys um, a small update as well, uh, I might be replanning um, how I'm going to do the layout of Malvern Junction. So, today I've just got one or two ideas at the moment. So, I don't know what I'm going to put on it, but we'll have a look. If I get any ideas, I'll let you guys know, do a video of this, and you're more than welcome to put anything down in the comments below if you've got any ideas for what I could put on the layout for Malvern Junction. 
please feel free to do that. You are more than welcome to do that. All comments are appreciated and they are very welcome as well. Considering how noisy it can be, uh, that's just on about 50% speed, probably 45. But it's a nice little runner, it's so smooth. You'd be amazed what you can buy these days. But the details on it is absolutely fantastic. I don't know if you can actually hear the, the converse, it sounds like it's actually chuffy. <laughs> it's quite a nice sound really. So we have an 060 Terrier, a Hawley brand, and it cost me £30 for it. Uh, I'm quite pleased with that really, I'm very pleased with it. So there you go, there's quite a bit of a detail looking on there really. So yeah, it's, it's a nice detail, very nice detail really. Well worth the £30. But as I say, I think it could do with a bit of a surface and a bit of a running in. Uh, but apart from that, it's a really nice loco. I really do love it. I love it more than the uh, 042. I love the 042s. Uh, there you go, everybody. That's something from uh, Malcolm Junction. Uh, it's a new addition to the fleet. Um, I have noticed uh, last night the uh, Four wheel coaches, the uh, small ones, about the same as this, the lab coat. Um, I've got about five of those, and the other newer four wheel what, uh, coaches, I've got exactly four of those. So I might do um, a video of the, the coaches for you and see what I've, uh, show you what I've got. So there you go, everybody. Uh, thank you so much for watching my videos. Um, I did upload one last night and straight away in four minutes somebody viewed it. I might know who that is, so if it is you, my friend, thank you so much. The one from the USA. And uh, there you go. So there's something new for you. So I will do some more videos. I'll do updates as well on other things. So I'm going to get all this sorted out, plan everything, and. Uh, you never know. Thank you everybody for watching, thank you for your time, thank you for your support, I do appreciate it. I do enjoy watching other people's um, uploaded videos and uh, I really do enjoy the content. So if you do like the content and you like the channel and you're not subscribed, please do subscribe to my channel. And if you give me likes, dislikes on the videos, you can even put uh, comments down on the videos if you've got anything that you want to share with me more than welcome to thank you so much i hope you enjoy this i hope there will be more people viewing my videos and more subscribers thank you guys for your time thank you so much have a wonderful weekend have a wonderful week next week and see you all soon thank you for watching morphin junction bye everyone